My name is Daryl Padone, and we're talking about the EVA cluster today. Yep, this is the new, the big announcement from uh, right. Monday morning. Yeah, from Monday, Mon Monday morning. Yep, twenty first. Okay. What we have here today is two sixty four hundreds. Okay. The two sixty four hundred arrays are still dual controller arrays. Sixteen shells behind them, being fronted by the storage virtualization services platform, and the platform is still consist of. Two VSMs, okay. One in each rack. Two data path modules. Again, one in each rack. This is to give you that resiliency yep. and the redundancy the necessary. Each of these devices now absorb data from the back end arrays. Okay. Right. They're absorbing the back end LUNs from your two sixty four hundreds, yep. and then they're going to virtualize them and serve that out to your environment. When you get the EVA cluster, the uniqueness about it is that we're going to configure all this for you. Okay. It arrives at your site, think about putting in two arrays, it's about the same amount of work, but the advantage is, is that not only do you get two arrays, you get the ability to scale out to four more. But wait, there's more! Always more. It's okay. HP. Okay. Right? Yep. We're always going to give you more. You get four more EVAs you can scale out that's going to give you a total potential footprint of 1.9 petabytes, Yeah. depending on your volumes yep. and how you configure them. Yeah. Additional value add services, you've got your thin provisioning, you've got your business copy, you've got continuous access also available for you. So, very nice scalable solution, very diversified because you can bring in additional EVAs to expand your system. Mm -hmm. And if you happen to have some of those other storage devices, yeah, you can bring we'll, let you, yeah, we'll let you okay. bring those in. I see. What uh, what's the potential customer for something like this? I mean, what's the size? What's the uh, the scope? I mean, so who's going to buy this? I would say this is mid size and above because the two EVAs are coming right off the uh, bat in the package. Okay. So you're already starting out at a fairly substantial footprint. Yeah. So I would say you know medium to uh, enterprise level customers. Yeah. Your small MBM, small medium business customers, not going to be looking for this much storage yeah. right off the bat.